Do you have a broken heart? Has it been broken so many times you don't know how to get through this one? Or has it been hanging on for a long time and you're just losing that enthusiasm that you once had for life? Or maybe you feel so mentally overwhelmed you just really don't know how you're gonna get over it. I know what that's personally like. My heart's been broken as well. Unexpectedly, why God did you allow this to happen? I didn't expect this. But there are answers. The fact that I'm standing here talking to you is proof that there's an answer. There's power to heal a broken heart. And it doesn't come from within ourselves or generally other people. It comes from Jesus. Jesus said that he has the power, supernatural power to heal broken hearts. And I can't explain it, how I've gotten through situations, how I'm getting through even right now. But it's the power of Jesus Christ and his anointing that's available for you as well. You know, there are a lot of people that will speak over you and say things that you don't need to hear. Like, how are you ever going to get over this? Or over time, you'll get over it as if you're going to have to wait so long and give up so much of your life because of what someone else did to you. No, that's not true. It's not true at all. I'm going to give you my secret weapon against a broken heart because in this world, our hearts can get broken. But our response to that broken heart is what's going to make the difference. The difference is going to allow us to overcome it and not be destroyed by it and not resort to other unhealthy uh, forms of dealing with it. I'm going to give you that scripture verse. It's found in the book of Luke, chapter 4, verse 18. It's really in fine print here. It says, The Spirit of the Lord is upon me because he has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted. And there you go. To proclaim liberty to the captives and recovery of sight to the blind to set at liberty, liberty those who are oppressed. So Jesus is saying, the Spirit of the Lord is upon me because He's anointed me to heal broken hearts, your broken hearts, supernaturally. You can claim this verse like I do. You can pray this verse. Lord, fulfill your word. I thank you for fulfilling your word in my life to heal my broken heart supernaturally, to mend it. See, Jesus knows your heart better than you know it yourself. And he knows how to heal it. He has the power to do that. And he loves you. 